Hey guys, it's Jamie here, back at it again in the Dragonvale video. Today I'll be telling you how to breed all the Chrysalis Dragons in Dragonvale. I also figured out the best place for the face cam, so if you guys like it, right here in the right hand corner, right below the food, I think that's a great spot. So yeah, I'm almost there for uh, three Chrysalis Dragons to level uh, 20, so that's pretty cool. But yeah, I'm going to tell you guys how to breed all of them today, because I've gotten that request occasionally, and I also want to put it up there for you guys too, so you know how to breed all of them. And I think it would be simpler than just doing one separate video for each of them. So, let's get on into this video for today. Also, for Dragonvale Mini Episode 15, I've also got some uh, Sapphire Dragons we're trying to collect for you guys, so we can do that. And so I can hatch them with you guys, which will be pretty cool. So I'm going to save this to, like, Saturday, and that's going to be a while, because today is, right now, is Saturday itself. But I'm waiting for next Saturday, so i got, like, seven days until the next one, or six or five. I don't know. I'm not going to count right now. I'm feeling up to it. But yeah, let's get into this video. And so I'm going to tell you to breed all of them, and then if you guys want me to put up one of my Crystal Dragons for myself, you can just ask me in the comment section if you want me to. And also, don't forget, you can only get these dragons during the Easter Egg event and also from Bring with Friends. So if you don't have one, try getting one from the Egg of Mystery or try getting lucky with Bring with other people. And you're only going to bring these dragons with bringing one Chrysalis dragon itself. So yeah, just want to let you guys know that because that's a big pointer out there to you guys. And you can't breed it right now because it's not a dragon you can breed with any other dragons in order to contain or get. But yeah. The Chrysalis Dragon, you'll need a Swallow Trail and also a Duskwing Dragon. The breeding pair of dragons must be a Swallow Tail and a Duskwing Dragon. The Duskwing Dragon, you'll need a Lancewing and a Chrysalis Dragon. The breeding pairs of dragons must be a Chrysalis Dragon and also a Lancewing. The Glowing Dragon, you'll need a Starwing and any Chrysalis Dragon. The breeding pair of dragons must contain any Chrysalis Dragon and Starwing Dragon. So I'm going to let you guys know. See right here how it says Star Wings on the right hand corner, and down here in the picture it says left hand corner. This goes to show that you don't need to breed it any specific way. You can put left, right, side, doesn't matter. It just matters if you get it or not. So just want to let guys know, I've always worried about that myself and say, wait, do I have to place it on this side or that side? Uh, and I've always asked the question, but I finally figured it out. It doesn't matter where you place it, it just matters if you get it. Just want to let guys know, because I can feel you right there if you don't understand or you're stressing out about it, and I can get you. The Lancewing Dragon, you'll need a Duskwing and also a Marble Tail Dragon. The breeding pair of dragons must contain a Duskwing Dragon and also a Marble Tail Dragon. The Marble Tail Dragon... Wait, did I do that one? Oh, no, I didn't. The Marble Tail Dragon, you only need to breed a Swallow Tail Dragon and also a Lancewing Dragon. And then a Star Wing, you will need a Glowing Dragon and also any Chrysalis Dragon. So I'm going to let you guys know again. Right, left hand corner, and the other one's in the right hand corner over here. Says the breeding pair of dragons must contain a any Chrysalis Dragon and a Glowing Dragon. So it doesn't matter which way you do it, it doesn't matter if you get it or not. But yeah, I hope the volume and audio is perfect for you guys right now, and also the music too. Because my last video in Dragonville Mini episode 14, the audio was spiking, and I did not like that myself, and I kind of got angry. I was just saying, dang it, I could have done better. So hopefully this time around, my audio is perfect, and I'm going to write a note, sticky note, saying this much for game audio, and this much for like mic audio, so just let me tell you. And then finally, the Swell Tail Dragon. You'll need a Marble Tail Dragon and a Chrysalis Dragon. The breeding pair of dragons must be a Marble Tail Dragon and also a Chrysalis Dragon. So yeah, I'm going to let you guys skim through these and I'm going to talk to you guys about a few things while we're doing so, okay? And I'm still going to listen to my game mod and make sure too, real quick. That always sounds nice. Now I'm going to start skimming down to the next three. Because there's only like seven Chrysalis Dragons in the entire game until they drop some during the next event. But the next event's going to be spooky and it's going to be probably during uh, midway of October. And then the winter event will be probably during Christmas time or around uh, December halfway through. So we'll have to see. They should make a Thanksgiving event. That would be interesting. I wonder if they're going to release any new dragons for uh, the events. But we'll have to see. They probably released some new dragons like a mummy dragon for the spooky event or some new spooky dragons. Which would be pretty cool. Yeah, um, but we'll have to see. I'm going to go back up, and yeah, that's how you breed all the Chrysalis Dragons in Dragonvale. And if you guys want to just go pause out, I think it could give you guys just enough seconds in order to pause the video and find where you're looking for or what dragon you're looking for. Don't forget, if this did help you out, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and don't forget, G-Man out. You guys are always the best.